Hey friends Alami, it's me Presley. Today we're going from noob to pro to hacker in the Pokemon trading card game live. Let's play! So I'm playing with a standard fire deck that I have adapted from like the standard Arcanine EX like default deck that they give you. So you guys are going to see a bunch of awesome cards. Also, I just ate a whole bottle of ketchup. That's the starting line that I chose for my guy to say every single time. But let's see, are we going to win this coin flip at the beginning? Let's see, what's it gonna be? What are they gonna choose? And it looks like they're going first. All right, we got this pretzel and we're totally gonna win this round. I'm 100% sure of it. Oh, nice, starting off with our Charmander. Gotta love that. All right, let's play that and head to their next turn. Six prize cards, we got this. You're kidding me. That's such a good basic card to start off with. Okay, that's fine though, because it's going to take a couple of turns to get Wild Impact to be able to play. But I mean, leading up to that, it's going to be pretty crazy. And they've got two of them? You're kidding! Alright, we got this. I've got a strategy for my next turn though, so it is A-OK. -okay. Can't believe we've got three Coridons. That is insane. Alright, let's go. They should be wrapping up their turn any second now. They're taking a little while. <laughs> All right, let's go. We want to start off with Jack. They've got four Coridon EXs. Oh, this is going to be a difficult game. Uh, at least... Okay, weaknesses and resistances aren't really going to work. Charmeleon? I mean, that's pretty good. But what we want to do is grab that to be able to get a Charizard and an Arcanine, preferably, into our deck. Then we'll play our rare can- Ooh, we can't because Charmander was only just played. Okay, let's use- Oh, we can't really use a double turbo energy. So let's go like that. Let's play Tail on Fire. Even though that is only going to do 10 damage, it's not that good. Let's just grab an extra fire energy, which is pretty useful. And that's at 2.30. So once we get Charizard on here, that'll be pretty good. Oh, we got a few Coco. Okay, we can put that guy down. I think we start by using our rare candy with our Charizard. There we go. Then put down a double turbo energy. We've already used a trainer, so that's all right. We can't do anything else with this. So we are good to do our flare blitz attack. Let's go. First attack of the game is insane. If we could get... Yeah, we've already got another fire energy and the burn brightly on our charizard is really really good because it gives us an ability which means every fire energy we need to use doubles which is so good dude that was mean i got really excited and you just completely eliminated our pokemon i mean i got, i mean we got to play that Let's go. Let's get our Charizard back, dude. I mean... Oh, wait. We can actually pull out our Radiant Charizard instead, which is really overpowered. Let's put that guy down instead. And... And let's put an extra fire energy on our Radiant Charizard and wrap it up by using a live... Co Why is that going to do zero? It's going to do no damage? You're kidding! No! I think that's got to be an ability that's being used somewhere. Um, all of your Pokemon take 20 less damage. All right, we haven't got any trainers or anything that we can use right now. This few Coco is going to get destroyed, which might be good because then we only need... We'll be able to destroy this guy in the next turn. Uh, we can't use Combustion Blast in the next turn. That's all right. If we can get super lucky and... Uh, I mean, it's not its not really luck, though, is it? Let's use this. Let's hope we can get either an energy or, like, a really good trainer that hopefully, like, professes luck or something like that that could reshuffle our whole hand so that we can get a bunch more trainers. Because right now, we are just stocking up on a bunch of evolution Pokemon that we can't use. There we go. Fukoko got absolutely destroyed. Bye, buddy. Uh, let's go. Selecting prize cards. That's not too bad because for each prize card they take... We get an extra uncolored energy, which is pretty good. So, Professor's Research, exactly what I needed. Exactly what I needed. We got one more energy that we can use. There we go. We could put on a double turbo energy, but I don't really want to right now. Because I don't think it's worth it. Let's put a Charmander down there, just in case we get lucky in the future. And I guess... I mean, we could put the double turbo energy on this guy. I think we do that. I think we put on a double turbo energy... Put an X. No! I've made a huge mistake. 
I forgot that the double turbo energy, it isn't an item. Pretzel army, it's an energy, of course. So now we can't do our giant strategy I was about to use, but we won't get destroyed because it used wild impact on its last turn and it can't use it two turns in a row, which is really good. Unless it swaps it out for another Pokemon, in which case that's not gonna be very good for us. Okay, 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 it's okay. We're back. Ultra Roll, let's use that and put down a Crocolore and a Boss's Orders. Let's do for both of those, and then we can get an extra Charizard. That's actually really good. All right, let's get an extra Charizard, and we can use our rare... Oh, no, it can only be used on the current one in play. All right, you know what we could do? Let's... Let's put that guy there. So now we've got the whole set. Use a boss's orders to swap it out for one like that, and then completely destroy the Coridon in one turn. There we go. That's pretty sick. Let's go grab both of these. Nice. Magma Basin and Ultra Roll. That's pretty good. And it doesn't look like they're doing much, so I don't think they can. Let's go. All right, it's our turn. Let's put down Magma Basin. Swap it out for an even better one, which means that we can grab a couple of extra energies. Let's go. Now, it did do 20 damage, but that's all right because we will be able to do some extra stuff really, really soon. Let's go ahead. We can't use Combustion Blast, but what we can do... All right, it does take a couple of energies. We might just have to leave it how it is right now. If we had a boss's order, we could use that, but I'm not sure we're going to be able to this turn. Instead, let's put that guy down there, and then... Oh, I think we want to end our turn. Let's cross our fingers that they don't have an extra fighting energy that they can use, but they definitely can because of the ability. No! Okay, it's fine because right now we're in a tie and we're in a winning position. So we'll be all good. If we could get a boss's orders, please. Level bowl. Okay, 90 HP or less. Might as well check. I don't think... Oh, we do. We've got a, a grow life. Sorry. <laughs> we can put that guy down and use combustion blast to destroy this guy. There we go, absolutely destroyed. Hopefully it pulls out great task. And oh, wait, we're getting some more cards. We're getting some more cards. What's it gonna be? Yo, some real nice ones. All right, please don't choose that one. Nice, perfect. I don't know what this guy was thinking with that turn because that was not a good choice. But let's go, we got this. So we're winning right now. And if we play our cards right, <laughs> Literally, if we play our cards right, we should be good. Oh, I'm scared though, Pretzel Army. I'm sure we can do it. Okay, I have to figure out a strategy that's going to be able to let us completely destroy our opponent here. I think we need to retreat. Yeah, I think we need to retreat and pull our Charmander out instead. Upgrade it to a Charizard with the rare candy. Then throw a basic... and Oh, let's check out this. And it does once during a turn from your bench to active spot. Okay. We might want to put... Let's just put that in our bench just in case we need it later on. But we might not because this might be one of our last turns. Oh, it's not... Okay, it's not going to be our last turn. But it's going to be a pretty powerful turn. Let's also just evolve this guy just for fun. All right, let's go. Destroy him! It'll be 150. But that's still pretty good. It's still getting us closer to our goal right here. Now, all we need is just one more fire energy to get back and be able to use our flare blitz once more. Okay? It destroyed it, but that's all right. That was all a part of the plan. Let's figure out what card we want to use next. Each damage counter. It doesn't have many damage counters. Uh, Bright flame. And then it does 40 damage for each energy. Okay. Let's bring... Uh, oh, I don't think we want to. I'm not sure what we want to do here, Pretzel Army. What's what's the best strategy? I don't know. Let's throw this guy in. That was not that was not the right choice. That was not the right choice. But we've got a couple more turns to figure this out. Uh, Magma Basin. Oh right, of course we can use that ability to pull out some extra cards. Yo, one only one of our bench Pokemon. That's okay. Let's slide that onto there. We might have to end this turn and just hope that we get an insane card next turn. Hopefully we can, Pretzel Army, because we are two cards away from winning this whole game. 
Oh, I'm, get, I'm getting nervous, pretzel army. Now's a better time than ever to tell you guys all about the merch over at presleyshop.com. We've got hoodies, we've got t-shirts, we've got plushies, so make sure to check all of it out because it is pretty insane stuff over there. So make sure to check out all of the merch over at presleyshop.com. Now, let's get back to this game and see what our opponent's doing. It's using a lot of trekking shoes, which is very scary. Okay, gift energy. As long as the card attached to a Pokemon, it provides one star energy. Okay, we've got a timer. I'm kind of panicking right now, Pretzel I'm going to be completely honest. Let's go. Energy switch. Uh, from one to another of our Pokemon. Is this going to let us move that to... Oh, no. That was not worth it. Can I go back? Mm, that's not good. Okay. Um, That was a bit of a waste. But, I mean... Let's use this. Let's use that. Put a fire energy only on the Pokemon. Oh, okay. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. This guy might get destroyed, but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It may have just completely destroyed him, but that's fine because we got a bunch more cards, which was my plan. It's totally my plan all along. Let's, uh, that's a double turbo energy, which is going to be pretty useful. Let's move our Radiant Charizard to our active spot. Let's give us a... Okay, extra energy. That's good. Search up to evolution Pokemon. That would be useful, but we don't really want evolutions right now. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's put down basic energy. We might be about to win this game. We could be about to win this game. Let's grab that. Put it down there. And... Uh, okay, let's grab that. And I mean, just for fun, let's evolve. But this might be the winning turn. Let's go. An extra combustion blast to destroy the Coridon. Put it to the discard pile. Let's grab our last two prize cards. And we've won this game and become a hacker. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. I can't believe we won this. Let's go. What's the matter? Poseidon got your tongue? <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Have the best day ever. Peace.